Toast is gonna come up in a bit. But until then, I realized something about Drill Chan. Let me just pop over to Twitch. Also, it's one in the morning. How's everyone doing? It's uh, kind of epic. Let me pop on over to Twitch. Also, new camera angle. It's high production shit now. Uh, until Toast gets here, I'm going to show you my realization on, on Drill Chan. Remember last time when I was working on it and the fucking spark shot out and shit? And I was like, oh, I don't know why. It's because I'm stupid. It's because I'm stupid. And I'll show you guys why I'm Okay, so to access the drill terminals, right? Which is our goal, which is what we want to do. Um, let's just fucking cut some plumber's tape and then you got, you got little terminals. So um, I think we need three because one of these is like temperature wire and the other two are plus or minus. And so I, 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 I marked out plus and minus just in case. Um, let me pull. Thank you, Jism, to see for the sub. All right. <laughs> One. <laughs> Two. Four. And then that's three. <laughs> so this is the battery, right? We put, you know, one in there for plus and one in there for minus. <laughs> and then we have access to it. Thanks for that one, two magic for the sub. Um, right, and then we have to figure out where uh, where the sensor wire is. And it turns out the sensor wire is here. So that means, thank you, Firestorm. So it's right next to the uh, plus terminal on the battery. So take our other little piece of plumber's tape, which is just conductive. Thank you, Zed. <laughs> so, uh, like I said, if for anyone uh, who is just joining us, Toast wants to do like kind of a coding meme together, and so this is just like waiting for him. I'm showing you guys what I realized. Thank you, Soviet Owen, for this up. Pop that right into there. <laughs> you have access to all 20 volts in the battery. Uh, thank you, and please 19 for this up. Let me get my multimeter. Uh, so. Let's see. Get your multimeter. Let me turn your multimeter on. Thank you for the sub. <laughs> for those of you who couldn't figure it out, I didn't read that name at all. Um, and yo dog one two one. Okay, bring it over to. Okay. All right, you guys can see that. Thank you just for well for the one gift sub. Look at that. Well, you know it's negative seventeen, and now it's plus seventeen. Well, cool. We have access to the terminals without having to put them. Directly into the drill. Thank you, duplicate toast for the sub. Right? And that's fuck. And then, that's the battery. We have access to the battery. Drill does go burnt sometimes. Um, let's see. Uh, what did I want to say after that? Oh yeah, alligator clamps. Thanks, Fire One for the sub. Just like last time. Thank you, late bonus for the sub. That goes there, right? Positive. We're gonna grab our negative on the minus, and also 145 for the sub. Super fucking wrong, by the way. And then you got that, right? And so if you touch these two together, yeah, you're gonna get, you know, some. You know, you're gonna get minor sparking. Uh, thank you, Nizzy McQueen, for the sub as well. Um, minor sparking, not a big deal, right? Uh, then, so what you want to do is then apply these to the motor, but um, like here, we can put it in like, remember purple is uh, plus five, plus, plus 20. Thank you, Fanatic Super for the sub. Put that there. You put the black on ground, which is the brown wire. Thank you, just some melon for the sub. And then the green goes on fence. Yeah, we're just fucking diving right into it, right? Ah, oh, shit. Okay, as well as Metal Man, 5 volts, <laughs> right? Look at this! Now, drill works when battery is out of drill, right? Right? We can all agree on this, right? Oh, thank you, Toast, for the raid. We're gonna be doing, um, coding stream very soon, whenever he gets up here, actually. This is just a pre-coding stream because this is important. I needed to fucking tell you guys because I was pissed off that I couldn't get it to work that one time. Thank you, this was for the for gamer. 
Alright, so the drill works right without that. So Thank you, Spiggy. One, two, three for the sub. Now, right, when we just cut off, um, all we need to do to make a control by chat is put a block in between here and just force that down. Thank you, Robin Van Hauser, for the sub. We don't need to bypass the trigger. We can just hold it down with a zip tie. That's what I'm fucking saying. Thank you, Gas Wiz, for the sub as well. There's some kind of... The drill is too high inductance to apply the, this, all this to it at once. I didn't take uh, electrical engineering in college, if you didn't realize. Thank you, Flores 3 ks I actually didn't take anything in college because I dropped out. Too high inductance for the motor. If we put it right on the motor, it does more sparks. Thank you, Unknown, for the sub. And if we do it just here, there's like a, we get a little bit of sparking right from the from the motor. Thank you, Waldo, 409 for the sub. This was right, right? Wait. Yes. Yes, Brown's got. Yes, Brown's got. Haha, <laughs> check the <laughs> Thank you, Yungagma, for the five kiss subs. Okay, so now all we gotta do, right, if we're just, you know, breaking it down into concepts, is I need to hold the trigger down and take off, you know, plus or minus equal. I'm just gonna take off minus. Thank you, Hope Attic, for the sub. So I'm gonna get a zip tie. Zip tie, right? This has the resistance in it, so the inductance of the motor doesn't freak out and shit the bed and don't let it move, right? So, <laughs> Zip tie the trigger down. Thank you, Lost Boy 2, for the sub. Um, <laughs> not what I thought I would be doing. I, thank you, Atarius, for the sub. Look at that. <laughs> no. <laughs> the drill is always on. And all you gotta do is. <laughs> like a little bit of sparking. <laughs> And you know what? There's a little bit of sparks. It's okay. Because <laughs> oh, Drill Chan lives, and that's what matters. Right? Now, what we need to do is just put some block in between here and here. That being a relay. Thank you, Biham, for the sub. And then <laughs> we're good to go. And that's how you do it. Let me get the relay. Oh, we'll be right back. Well, that's somewhere. Let's pop this into the five on the Arduino. Um, five, six. Yeah, pop this into the five on the Arduino. Pop this into the ground on the Arduino. And this might be able to go into ground as well. No, I think it's the five as well. Oh, thank you for 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 us for the link <laughs> itself. All right, there it is. <laughs> There's only one five volt, so I have to like hit the hit the pin as it's poking out. But there you can see a relay is turning on and off. That's fucking epic. Thank you for for noticing. Big brother K22. Thank you for the sub. Okay, and it's a little more interesting if we get out this guy. You're literally shoving bits of metal into battery terminals at as, as an EE. This is so disgusting. Don't fucking talk to me if you went to school for this. I didn't. Spoonix, thanks for the sub. Man, they're all like <laughs> spaced out. It's fine, right? It's all right. They're not sparking or anything. Thank you, 7red77 for the sub. Okay. We gotta check where's the normally closed. Those are the normally closed, so we're gonna put it in the normally open, which is on the left. Thank you, Lee Courtney, for the sub. Michael, could you do this with a MOSFET? Yeah, if I fucking went to school for it, probably. Um, let me get a uh, different. Thank you, Sir Hacker, for the sub. I'm gonna pop these different probes in. On the ground over there. Thank you, Lonely Teen, for the sub. Um, let me check a little bit. Okay, let me plug that in. 
to the multimeter for the little continuity test meme. Boop. Boop. Now remember, on the multimeter when we're doing continuity tests, thank you Chocoboy34 for the sub, it go beep, beep when it completes the circuit on these two probes. So, beep. Beep make, means metal is touching, right, between the two probes. That's all you gotta know. Thank you, it's Kella for the sub. Which means electricity can flow between the points the probes are on. Thank you, Hans Kermin for the sub. So... If we take a little wire, I'm gonna take one of these guys, and I'm gonna throw, I'm gonna just clip the little probe on here. Go beep boop. He's going the normally closed, or the normally open, so excuse me. And just clamp the screw on it. Thank you, Sruvel, for the sub. And clamp the next screw terminal down on it. Thank you, Quilix, for the sub as well. And then we go beep. Oh, actually. And then I touch this little signal meme to 5 volts. Thank you, Dennis Lex, for the sub. Oh, beep! Oh, it go beep! That means the relay is working. Thank you, thank you, chat. Thank you, fucking thank you. I appreciate it. This means the relay is working. It means it's closing the circuit and, we're, and it's fucking working. That means we can close the drill's battery circuit instead of uh the multimeter thank you captain michael cabo for the sub bing bong bing bong boom it's not turning on yet because we haven't closed the relay right right chat i know you knew that thank you growing blaze for the sub so when we do connect the relay just by touching these little pins together Ooh, 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 fucking easy. It wasn't even that fucking hard. It just took me an entire day and I couldn't do it that one. Nightmare. Should I say something? Chat. Uh, Pog champ. If it's fixed. Fine, fine, fine. Nightmare. Perfect, perfect. Well, they say perfect and Pog champ. Yeah, yeah. Saying. All right, we're good. Okay. Um, came at a weird time. No, um, are you in the middle of finishing something here? Uh, no. It's we we got to like a good point where it's like, this is the um. I want chat to be able to control the drill because mm -hmm. the drill is kind of like a like a, a background meme on the, uh -huh. on the stream. So um, I want to like make it so like through like subs or just chat or whatever they're able to make it like, turn uh, on and off and spin and shit. Yes. And so. So what's the, this thing? Is that the battery? That is the battery. That is the battery. And normally the battery just hooks in here to the bottom of the drill, like your battery does. Oh, okay. How do you interface with the drill? So, that's n normally where the battery goes in. The yes. battery goes up here to this trigger. And so, like, you grab it like this. The oh. Trigger, right. And the trigger then sends, like, the appropriate amount of electricity, like, based on how hard you, you yeah. push it, right? Um, to here. So, you know, honestly, I was thinking, wow, I didn't expect the, the like the makers of this drill to have like a, <laughs> like a little interface, like an interface, <laughs> like a you, what's the phrase? Like a little API. API. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, wow, this thought a, it was like an internet of things. Yeah, drill. I'm like, wow, they have, have a Arduino <laughs> API for this drill, and now I realize it's just powering it on and off because you have this thing which is constantly pressing yeah, it. Because it's a, yeah, you gotta have a zip tie on yeah. it. So um, yeah, so. This is normally connected, but we're breaking it with a relay, and the relay is going to the Arduino, and the Arduino turns on if you, like, poke this guy into the little guy. Is that mine? Yeah. Alright, alright. How's that, Chad? Better? Okay. Fix? Okay. 
So if you poke this this one into, you can grab it. Is it Just to anyone? No, that. So it's it's m it's more like you need to poke it on the metal that's going into there because there's only one five volt interface. So you just try, yeah, aim for the little shiny metal on the. Um, like at, at the like, side. Like um, yeah, yeah, at the side of where it's going in. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Touching the. Yeah, to the. <laughs> it's sick. It's fucking sick. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that closes the loop, and then it's gonna turn on. So now okay. instead of an Arduino. You know, now you're a little too loud. <laughs> There's a there's a middle ground here. Thank you, Care Bear Sixteen, for the sub. What do you do for subs? By the way? Do you just like read out every one or? Uh, Does Facebook have subs? I we have asked supporters. That. Okay. But my strategy back on Twitch towards the end was to just ignore it. Mm. Cause I feel like if I do it for everyone, but I miss a couple, those couple people feel, feel very bad. bad. Yeah. But if I ignore all of it. Then no one ever feels bad. Ah, they're all just like it's like getting all C's in school. So yeah, like <laughs> setting the you don't feel bad if everyone fails a test. Yeah, only if one person fails the test. I understand. Yeah, my reading comprehension is quite low, so I usually just will kind of like gloss over the major letters in mm -hmm. the name and kind of make a name out of that. Well, where do you where do you have the list of people? So I haven't looked into how to do that yet. So when so this you just pops read it up, as it comes along. So when this pops up on OBS, I will now read that guy whose name was like Wombat, Wombat. 370 something. 1665. Sure thing it was. <laughs> Big bad never I, I feel yeah. like you get too much subs to read them all out Thank though. You. Oh I try. I damn I sure do try. And, and what about the one maybe uh -huh. this guy disappears. I'll just say thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and it sounds like how I read names normally, because I'm very bad at reading comprehension. Uh, okay, I'm starting to. S okay, I think yeah. they want the overall volume rate. The overall volume, so that's gonna be an OBS. You're, you're yeah. becoming really good at this. Like you want, you. you want it to hit the yellow on the regular. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, oh, yeah, we'll pick it out a little yeah. bit. Thank you, stereotype Krogan, for the sub. It's like a tick now reading them. All right, you want. You want to teach some people some coding? Yeah, man, let's teach some people some coding. Thank you, Brian, for the sub. <laughs> Um, let me move all this okay, stuff yeah, out of the way. Go, yeah. We'll just move all this stuff. You wanna, you can throw it on that table. Yeah, you just fucking throw it on that. Let's unplug that guy. Yeah, that's fine. That can go on the ground. That's fine. These guys, don't wanna touch these guys. <laughs> you know, on the, uh, when I first took the drill apart, mm -hmm. I, uh, like, I didn't realize how much, um, not impotence, but how much, Fuck, I didn't take EE e. in college, but uh, how much something the motor had. So when I touched it, like, I was just casually hooking shit up, and it was just like, fucking... Oh my fucking, god! And, I, like, you can see me, I'm like, in the video, I've watched it. <laughs> Again, I'm just like, that's okay, that's okay. And I'm, I absolutely didn't expect that to happen, right? Because it's fucking sparks everywhere. Also, at the time, there were three Twitch staff in the chat, and I was like, guys... I think there's still staff in the chat right This now. is all right. I say not to do it at home, so don't do it at home, right? Does, does that make it okay? Yeah. To Twitch? Also, it's not like these are like, it's not like this is killer volt. Like, this, these are the ones that were sparking, right? Right. I touch it, it's fine. It's it's like high amperage, low voltage. Oh, so it's, okay. I touch it, it's fine. You don't want to lick it, but it's not going to anywhere close to kill you, right? Five staff in the chat. That's fine. It's fine. It's safe. You touch it with your hand. It's it's not gonna kill you. Thank you. Just for the sub. Oh yeah. Move that over on that table. Stuff 